You want me to cut it? I said cut it. By the time I said cut it, the second time the bitch was coming out the goddamn tank. I said, ain't this about a bitch? Cook, cook me a steak and invite me to your damn house, nigga. Child, I ain't cooking you no goddamn steak and I ain't eating the motherfucker. Man, cook me a steak, man. God. I need to go to the health food store and get me some darn mushrooms because I can cook a mushroom just like how um, I would cook steak. Hell, so I cook up the eating steak and cook a nigga one. Child, child. Come on, they have steak and come on, they have steak and wine. Uh, I don't, I don't cook steak for everybody. Man, I thought I'm your dog. Yeah, you is. That's why, that's why I give you the scraps. <laughs> Asian sausage you put in the pan with it and I just put that over some um some uh jasmine rice and I'm just gonna eat that for the week I got two bags so I got enough to last me for next I really ain't got to go um uh grocery shopping for the following week because I got enough stuff to last me for the two weeks actually um but y'all know how fruits and vegetables is they go bad quick and then for breakfast I've been eating well to break my fast I've been eating um mangoes and uh green grapes so, yeah, my shades on because the sun is out. I thought it was gonna rain. <laughs> they don't, it's fine with me, child. It is fine with me. Yeah, have y'all seen like the cars with the darn emblem um, lights on their doors? I got some of my doors I bought um probably like a year, maybe two years ago. Well, I didn't buy my father bought them for me from um, a, a gift. And um, over time, it, 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 the light either goes out or freaking uh, water gets in it from the rain or whatever so my emblem on my lights don't even look like a Mercedes emblem you can't even tell what it is to be honest with you so I bought some uh, replacement ones to put in my doors so when I get to work I'm gonna go ahead and replace them because I forgot to put them in when I was um, leaving work the first time and you just easily I'll show y'all how I do it you just um, basically disconnect the light and that to connect the light from the door to the new light and then just slide it back into the slot so that way, um, at nighttime when I open up my door, it's a Mercedes emblem show, which I very seldom sell. So I can't even talk. Can I get my words up? God. I very seldom um, have my lights on in my car, especially at nighttime. I hit the little light on top of my dashboard or whatever that when I, so when I open my doors, the inside light don't come on. Cause I don't like people looking all in my goddamn face, child. Y'all know that. <laughs> So I turned, I hit the button for that. So um, when I turn that off, my door lights don't work. So in order for my people to see my door lights, I have to turn my lights on in my car at nighttime, which I might do sometimes but when I be wanting to be seen. But child, half time, I don't be wanting to be seen, child. So I leave my lights off in my darn car at nighttime. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna put those in when I get to the yard. And like I said, I made a meal prep while I was um, on break. I made the Asian stir fry, which y'all seen. And then I also made like a salad. This is my first time making a salad. And it's um just cucumber sliced up with some um sweet pepper sliced up and uh uh tomatoes. And what I do is I season it with some Himalayan salt and some pepper. And then when I get ready to eat it, I'ma eat it with um balsamic vinaigrette. But you know what? I ate it. I ate a bowl of it because I had some excess left over and I think I would add some um banana peppers next time I do it. 
So I got enough stuff in there to make another helping of it. So, like I said, I don't think I need to grocery shop next week or this week coming up. Cause I got enough stuff to last me for another week. And it's, you gotta tell me twice, child. Cause I, I just went to Walmart, child, when I had Havana. And I guess it was because I had Havana. Cause usually I can go to Walmart and spend a hundred dollars or less. Man, I went to Walmart this time. That bill said a hundred seventy-two dollars. I said, damn, who you rung up with me? got some personal items that I had to read and needed to restock up on too so but yeah y'all let me put this camera down I'm pick y'all back up once I get to the yard okay y'all I'm back so like I said <laughs> boy I tell you so these are the lights I bought um and they go on my door let me make sure these are the right ones child and they real easy to assembly that's why I like them um they look like this And this little wire thing, you just take the wire, disconnect it from your door, and then plug this one in, and then just slide it back in the slot. Easy, one, two, three, child. But I pray these. Wait, why this one ain't connected to no wire? Don't tell me I got to connect the wire. Oh, man, okay. I guess they try to do that to save the battery. I'm gonna do one. Yeah, so plug it in the and then show y'all. So the light is under here. And just pop it out. Yep. Look like the same one. Yep, it's the same one. So just pop that out. I'm gonna connect it. Now I'm turning it off. I'll probably show y'all um what the light look like tonight so y'all can see it on the um because y'all ain't gonna be able to see it right now because the sun's still out. But um, let me get situated at work and I get back with y'all here in a bit. Okay, so y'all, I'll just put in this, but this is what the emblem kind of look like. So at nighttime, it'll say Mercedes Benz when I open it like that. And y'all, I didn't need the extra wire that came with it. I just I used the wire outside the door and plug it into the darn piece itself. So, yeah, this is what it looked like. So Mercedes Benz. Yeah, I'm just not getting off. It's like 11.45, but I just wanted to show y'all this light that I was talking about on my coal. Since it's nighttime now, y'all can see it better. That's the light. All right, let me get my ass Hey, y'all, hey, y'all, hey, y'all. It's Sunday. Back at work again. <laughs> um... I'm gonna tell y'all yesterday what happened. So, y'all remember I told y'all about that dude that took me out for my birthday, whatever. The one that I um worked with. He worked for the company that come and fuel our trucks. So why yesterday? Usually when I'm filling the truck so that we do hand signals, I always tell them to cut it because sometimes um some of their trucks have a hose to where I don't have a nozzle on it, so I have to tell them to stop it from the truck because I can't stop it from the top of the uh from the hose or whatever while I'm filling it. So. Um, this dude, I either say cut it or I do like the hand signal like this and I tell him I slash my hand or whatever. So yesterday I'm on top of the truck or whatever, filling up the darn thing and sometimes it'll stop to where he got to swap tanks on his truck. So I had got to that point to where he had to swap tanks on his truck yesterday. And, but my tank was almost filled. It was probably like this much left to fill up. And normally what happened is when they swap tanks, it'd be so much press to build up to the water fluid. The gas gonna come out quicker than what it normally does when it's already filling. So by doing that or whatever, I told him, I said, hey, when you swap tanks, stay by the clicker, you know, cutoff thing because it's almost at the top anyway. So it's probably going to stay, um, it ain't going to take that long to fill, probably like two or three seconds, then you have to cut it off again. So, uh, I guess he didn't hit me because the motherfucker started the goddamn pump. And I waited two or three seconds, got to where it was supposed to be at, where I wanted the fill line that I wanted to, for it to stop at, and I'm telling him to cut it. I said, cut it. I didn't do no hand signals. I just said, cut it. I looked up my head, and I said, cut it. I seen him look at me, go towards the, the, the switch, hesitate, come back to me, look at me, and say, you want me to cut it? 
said cut it. By the time I said cut it, the second time the bitch was coming out the goddamn tank. I said, ain't this about a bitch. Then, that's not what pissed me off. What pissed me off was he gonna try to beat me getting mad. So, after everything went down or whatever, he finally cut it. He was like, oh, I was looking for a hand signal and this, that. I said, how you looking for a hand signal and you look dead at me when I said cut it the first time? You went towards the clicker, hesitated, turned back around, asked me, did I say cut it again? Because you weren't sure. I don't know what the heck. Child. The shit pissed me off. Because after the whole situation happened, he tried to beat me, get mad, and say, um, just from here on out, just, I was looking for the hand signal, just use the hand signal. What? If anything, I want somebody to tell me what to do then versus, you know, use the hand signal because I could just be shooting a fly. And you think I'm telling you to cut it. But that's not the point. Even if you don't, even if you think I said cut it or didn't say cut it, what's the worst that can happen if you cut the bitch off? All you gotta do is cut the motherfucker back on. The hell? Now the worst that can happen to me when I tell you to cut it and you don't cut it, the bitch come up and it overflows and I gotta clean up fucking gas off my truck, off the sidewalk, off the pavement, gotta put down fucking kitty litter, sweep that bitch up, put down puppy pads, soak them bitches up. Like, eh that can happen when I, you cut it off short and I didn't tell you to cut it is you click the fucker back on. Excuse my language, y'all. But that motherfucker pissed me off yesterday and the fact that the, the whole thing that pissed me off was he gonna try to be just from hell and I just use the hand signals. When he said it, I, I, I said, uh-huh. And put my head down. Don't fuck with me. Y'all know I'm petty, y'all. Y'all know I'm petty. Y'all know I'm petty. Don't fuck with me. We gonna use hand signals from hell and I, all right. I ain't even gonna say cut it. Cause the motherfucker act like he don't hit, see my darn hand signals when I say, so I have to use hand signals and say cut it at the same time. But watch, <clears throat> the day from here on out, don't ask me if I said cut it. Play me if you want to. Shout out that motherfucker pissed me off. Then he got nerd to myself when it, every, it, everything was all said and done with. He told me, oh, you mad at me? I said, I ain't mad at you, but you ain't about to sit here and assault my goddamn intelligence and make it seem like it was my fault. If it was my fault, then yeah, I'll take the blame for it. I ain't got no problem with taking the blame if this is my fault. Shit, everybody fuck up. People make mistakes, this, that, and third. But that shit was your fault. When I said cut it, I know you heard me say cut it because you went towards the clicker to cut it off. You hesitated. Turn back around because you second guessed yourself. Turn back around and ask me, did you say cut it? Bitch, by the time I said cut it the second time, the bitch was coming out the damn tank. From hell on I'm used to you using hand signals. If I use hand signals or say it or not, what you, I, I'll prefer somebody to say it. You looking dead at me. I can feel you looking at me when I'm standing up there on top of the goddamn tank. So, child, we're not starting that off today. Today's Sunday. Today is the Lord's Day. I was listening to my gospel music. It's 946. I don't have to clock in until 955. Um, let me get back to listen to my god darn gospel. At least one more song before I get out. Just kind of get my mind right, child. I just want to pick y'all up and tell y'all what happened yesterday. Um, I probably won't pick y'all up again until when I get off. When I get off, y'all, I got to do a load of laundry. I need to edit a um short to put out from last vlog, and I need to edit a vlog uh, that's gonna go out Tuesday. And y'all, y'all probably this probably be out after the fact, but I'm thinking about going live. I ain't thinking about going, I'm, I'm stepping out my comfort zone. I'm going live Friday, child. I don't know what the heck I'm gonna talk about. I don't know how many people gonna show up. If it's a, it ain't nothing but one person, it's better than nothing, child. But yeah, I just want to be interact more with y'all or whatever. My supporters, because y'all been there since day one. But yeah, let me get my mind right. I'll talk to y'all later. <laughs> I need to put my schedule in for work. I don't know if I want to do Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and have because my off days is Thursday and Friday, and I usually do Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Thursday I go work out and I'm off, but the only reason I do Thursday is because they give me a reason to get out of the house instead of sitting in the house all day. But I got so much work I can do in the house to where I don't know if I'm just gonna do Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, or do go back to my four full my vacation coming up now i got three weeks to my vacation so i might need to go ahead and do four days but i want to over exalt myself and do like monday tuesday wednesday and thursday fuck it we pushing it we're gonna do monday tuesday wednesday and thursday workout y'all the waistline gets slim i started uh, yesterday i put my own um, waist trainer back on while i was at work i do that shit dick cause boy i about died <laughs> But I'm going to start again tomorrow 
but um I used to wear waist trainer all the time when I was driving trucks. I used to put it on in the morning before I drive because I can't sit in a drive for long periods of time and my posture don't be straight because my back start feeling weird and irritating. They irritate me. So I um I forgot the thumbs up the darn thing. My back be feeling weird, so I I um I try to wear a waist trainer. And I wasn't wearing it to, wait, to shape my waist. I was wearing it more to keep my posture straight as I drive. So I'm going to get back into waist training or whatever. Uh, starting tomorrow. Ooh, whatever. I was one time yesterday. Just test it out on the first part of my shift. Boy, look at here. You talking about I couldn't even. My, my back was so straight to where when I was getting out of the truck, I was sliding out the truck. I wasn't just, you know, bending over and getting out. I was sliding. I had to turn my thighs. Child. Anyway, let me go. I'm still rambling. I keep talking about let me go and I keep talking. Bye, y'all. <laughs> I just came back to show y'all. Focus. I just came back to show y'all my um salad. So I put the salmon vinaigrette on there and then uh Himalayan salt and pepper. But it's sweet peppers, cucumber, and tomatoes. So good. Y'all, this is the I be working in. It wouldn't be bad if the wind wasn't blowing. The wind blowing like it's about to be a goddamn tornado. I can't stand this rain. I hate it. I hate it here. I'm about to move to Florida. I want to move to Florida. No, the hell you don't. Because you, one, one minute it'd be bright and sunny, hot, and the next minute it'd be doing this. Say what well, yeah, I'm trying to tell you. Y'all, it didn't got worse. Look how that wind blowing like it's a hurricane. Ugh. This is my, I, don't want, I had the nerve to put on my new wig. I should have kept the old one on. Oh, have mercy. And you know, it'd be a pouring down like this, and people, a truck would ride up alongside me, think I'm about to get them gas. Hey, and you don't get your behind go, go on down up to that warehouse until it start raining and bring that motherfucker back up. I am not getting out in this. You lost your everlasting mind. Shad, these people be so retarded. I expect me to get out of this give you some goddamn gas. Would you get up? Update y'all. Still getting wet. These are the best like protein bars. It's peanut butter and um chocolate. It tastes so good. Maybe I'm just hungry. I got it from Walmart. Called Ready Clean. So good, child. It's 2.30. I still got an hour and 30 as soon as i get comfortable here come a goddamn truck child six o'clock yeah i'm about to go to the house what i need to do it's a lot of stuff i need to do i need to edit a vlog because i need to put a vlog out tomorrow and do a thumbnail i need to wash and braid this hair yeah i done made a whole complete list ask me if i'm gonna do it or not i'm sitting here got y'all sitting here looking at me while i'm writing a paragraph back to somebody Um, I was supposed to call my homeboy back. He told me to call him. He called me when I was at work, but I had an attitude and I ain't had the time. He be wanting to kiki. And I got, you know, you got to have the right attitude to kiki with somebody. Um, what I'm eating for dinner, I got some um, potatoes. I think I'm going to put some of them in the air fryer with some barbecue sauce. I might sprinkle a little queso cheese on top. I want to be a little rescue. I might. Oh, I can stop somewhere and grab me something. I'm trying to think. Yeah. What's up? Hey, where you got that damn thing from? Your, your car? Uh-uh. I'm about to start. Uh-uh. I'm about to start charging you. I'm about to start charging you. I need commission. Hey, don't worry about all that. I'm going to buy one. I need commission on my license. Now, I got to have Amazon. Okay, that's where I'm finna get it from too. I'm it's for Audi though. Same for Audi. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They got some nice ones on there for Audi. They got the uh, it'll be like the three circles then. Who put it on for you? I did. You know, okay, this the same. Is. is that easy? Yeah. You, oh, you trying to be funny? <laughs> <laughs> Watch it now. Watch it now. Watch it now. And you think, boy, I can't, I, I can't some, boy, I can't some shade. I catch some shade now. <laughs> Damn, no, no. Yeah, I just got off. Well, I got off about an hour ago, but I just, I'm about to leave workout class. About to head to the house. Oh. I got to find me something to eat. Unless I'm going to eat something at the house. I got some leftovers. 
I got some stir fry I made. I made an Asian stir fry because you know I ain't eating no darn meat, child. You still ain't eating no damn meat? Mm, I just started on the 4th of July. Well, after the 4th of July. After I did my little detox. Who? Who? I can, boy, hey, look here. I can cook a mean ass steak, boy. Cook, cook me a steak and invite me to your damn house, nigga. Child, I ain't cooking you no goddamn steak and I ain't eating the motherfucker. Man, cook me a steak, man. God, I need to go to the health food store and get me some darn mushrooms because I can cook a mushroom just like how um, I would cook steak. Hell, so I cook up the steak and throw a cook a nigga one. Child, child. Come on, let's have steak and come on, let's have steak and wine. I, I don't, I don't cook steak for everybody. Man, I thought I was your dog. Yeah, you is. Yeah. That's why, that's how I get you the scraps. <laughs> <laughs> hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all. Good morning. It is Tuesday morning. Y'all know I slapped on this old wig because why? Like it's about to rain again today. I don't feel like working in no goddamn rain again. I hate working in the rain, but I got to do what I got to do, child. That's the only bad thing about this job, besides them damn employees at that company. Uh, is whatever the weather is, that's what you're working in. That's your office for the day. But yeah, like I said, it's Monday. I'm um, to my Monday. We ain't going back. It's Tuesday morning. <laughs> I need to put something in these lips. They ash okay? If I haven't already, this is a good lip balm. I need to order me some more. Laneige, this is really good. But I'm about out of that. I, I, I like that so much too well. I done flipped upside down in the car. In the uh, ashtray holder just so I can um, get the, the rest of it to the bottom. And I can squeeze it out. But right now we're gonna put some lip oil on. Usually I use Vaseline and um Ulta um lip gloss. I need to go give me some more of that too. We might do that. This week on the mouth, I don't know. But yeah, it's Tuesday. On my way to work. Hopefully I have to work in the rain all day. I'm going to work out after. Um the last time I talked to y'all probably seen me. Oh, I was on the phone with my homeboy. I came home yesterday, um, edited a vlog, put that out. Uh took a shower of course um and then i ended up making me some darn um fries in the air fryer and just eating that and i had some grapefruit juice and some pink grapefruit juice i didn't eat the grapefruit but i got me some grapefruit for this morning but yeah i'm rambling let me get to work it's 9 17 i'll to pick y'all back up either at work or probably when i get off um and head to the gym did i grab my gym bag yeah i did all right let me go Hey y'all, done from work at workout class. Now I be wearing the same stuff to work out. Class don't start until it's 4 37 right now. Class don't start until 5. Well, I'm going at 5. Class don't start at 5 15. And that's 45 minute class. <sighs> y'all, tomorrow's my Friday. I am ready. And tomorrow should be an easy day because all I do is work. Come to workout class, but we're not working out. We're doing this accountability meeting for the month. So we just sit around, we don't have to do a workout. But I probably do like a little walk or whatever um, before class start just to get some type of steps in. Uh, but other than that, child, I feel like we be meeting up at the same places in the car. I yeah, I'm in here. I see y'all Thursday, child. Um, y'all be done seen this video already. I probably be done went live already because I'm planning on going live this Friday. We're gonna see how that go. Might be two people show up, might not, but hey, it is what it is. One person better than none. If you have made it this far, thank you for watching. If you haven't already, go hit that like, hit that subscribe button, turn your notification bell on so you'll be notified when I post another video. And yeah, look at me trying to hype myself up because I don't feel like doing it. <laughs> Bye.